Immediate help following the series of earthquakes in Turkey and Syria. News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti joins us live in studio. Patricia, the local nonprofit is sending different types of aid. Well, crews at Direct Relief are trying to get medical aid and other supplies to areas hardest hit by the earthquake as the death toll, already exceeding 7,000, continues to rise. In the hours following the catastrophic earthquake in Turkey and Syria, crews at Direct Relief in Santa Barbara have had no time to waste. Time to get to work. This is what Direct Relief does. We're uh, an emergency response support company that supports local health networks in areas that are suffering from natural disasters, civil conflict, economic collapse. The initial 7.8 magnitude earthquake centered in southern Turkey was followed by multiple 6.0 magnitude quakes. So far, Direct Relief has committed $200,000 to help their global partners in Turkey and Syria. Our initial response was for the search and rescue. So we are working with Akut, who is the largest search and rescue organization in Turkey right now. Crews are preparing these pallets for shipment to Turkey and Syria. There's also prenatal vitamins there for pregnant mothers. Direct relief managers say the region is also experiencing below freezing temperatures. This creates health risks for people who have been displaced due to collapsed buildings. My hope is that we are able to maintain our connections with our partners on the ground as well as make new connections in the area. Over the next several weeks, Direct Relief's team will focus on bolstering the availability of medical items. Time is always sensitive in these situations. The quicker that we can make contact, the faster our response can be, and hopefully the more lives that we can impact. And Direct Relief is projecting the number of deaths will triple in the coming weeks. Very devastating. Beth and Scott, back to you. All right, thank you, Patricia.